Good evening and thanks so much for joining us. I'm Tamika Alexander. Topping the news tonight, the Alabama Fire College held their graduation today and they had a very special graduate. WVUA 23's Ivy Irvin went to the graduation and joins us now with more on who that person is. Ivy. Tamika, this story is one that some have said only happens once in a lifetime and I'd have to agree. 15 years ago, paramedic Jason Norris went on a call to save a 10 year old boy. Today, Norris says that call was one he'll never forget. In 2003, I was working on the ambulance one evening, pouring rain, so hard you couldn't see to drive, and we answered a call of a child that had been shot. Norris says when he arrived at the scene, the child was barely alive. On the way between Lake Tuscaloosa and Druid City Hospital, I put two liters of fluid in him as fast as I could squeeze it, just knowing that. He was a dead, dead boy that there was probably nothing they're going to be able to do. But today, 15 years later, paramedic Norris gave Tyler Smith, the child who had a bullet through his chest, his paramedic certificate. And Smith says because of that night and Norris saving his life, becoming a paramedic means so much more to him. That night kind of turned things around for me and made me find a direction and kind of led me to, to this. Smith says what happened was an accident. A friend of his was playing with a gun and the gun accidentally went off, taking Smith's thumb off and putting a hole through his chest. But he believes that everything happens for a reason. I think God puts us everywhere for a reason and you know he was he was there for me that night. Smith says that now he hopes to save others' lives, just like Norris did for him. I hope that one day I can I can change someone's life the way he changed mine. And Norris says he's positive that Smith will be a great paramedic. It certainly is a, a neat coincidence that now he's going to have the opportunity to do the same things that I've done. A huge congratulations and good luck goes out to Smith and all of the other graduates as they begin their careers as para paramedics. Reporting live tonight, I'm Ivy Irvin, WVUA 23 News.